I just finished up at the gym, so I'm just about to leave and go home now. Um, I think I showed this in a different video, but every time I finish up at the gym, I just wipe my face down. I'm just gonna focus with this uh, micellar water, just because we have to wear a mask, obviously, at the gym, so I uh, like to wipe any of like the dirt and bacteria and stuff that gets stuck under there, so I did that, and now I'm gonna go home. Okay, I'm home now, and I'm just making some tacos with vegetarian ground meat and uh, bell pepper. I don't really have any lettuce other than this pre-mixed one, so I'm just gonna take some out of there. And then I have salsa, hot sauce, sorry, <laughs> hot sauce, um, cheese, and yeah. Okay, so here is the finished result. They look terrible because I just kind of like dump the stuff on them, but <laughs> that's what it's looking like. I'm going to eat this and then shower and start some schoolwork. This is what I wore to the gym today, by the way. I've shown it in a different video. It's a little set from Amazon. Um, and then I just have this like furry jacket on because it's really cold out today. Hi guys, I'm just about to start doing my schoolwork now. I have my iced coffee, of course, um, and a little snack. Um, I just took a nap, not gonna lie. <laughs> so I feel a little bit out of it now, but I did not sleep well at all last night, so I needed that nap. Um, and now I need to do some schoolwork, so. I just made this HelloFresh meal. Um, this is what it's actually supposed to look like with halloumi cheese, but I can't really eat that much of it, so I only have a couple of pieces. Um, but yeah, I'm just waiting for my boyfriend to get home, and then we're gonna eat this. Hi guys, um, it's the next morning. I just finished my coffee and breakfast, and I'm about to go get ready for the gym. Today's the last day, I think, that um, that I can go to the gym because they just announced another lockdown, so. I'm just trying to stay positive, so. Let's just get this last little workout in and uh, then I have to come back and do some school stuff. So let's get to it. Before I go to the gym, I'm going to make a shake because um, today the only spot I was able to get for the gym is 12.15. So it's kind of during my lunchtime. So I know that I'll be hungry and I want to hit legs and glutes. So I definitely need to be full, so I'm gonna make a protein shake before I go and drink it on the way there. Um, today I'm gonna have, I just got this like little sample of this vanilla Vega one, and I'm gonna put bananas, blueberries, um, spinach, uh, Greek yogurt, and almond milk. Okay, so I'm gonna pick my outfit for the gym. This drawer is a disaster. I just have like all my active wear shoved in here. Oh my god. Um, look at this mess. I think I need to organize this when I get home. But um, I'm just going to pick my outfit. So I think I'm going to wear just my black Align leggings. Is that what they're called? Align? I don't know. Anyways, Lululemon <clears throat> leggings. And then I was thinking maybe just like a red sports bra. I don't know. I'm going to take a look in here. <clears throat> and decide what color sports bra I want to wear. Um, I have a whole bunch, so let's see. Okay, so here's some of them that I pulled out. I'm thinking maybe this <clears throat> like long line pink one, or I don't know why, but I'm like being drawn to red today, which is so weird. It's not really my typical color that I choose, but. Hmm, I don't know. Or also, like, this one, it's just a really simple, it's inside out, but it's just, like, a really simple one. It's kind of long line, um, but it's really comfortable, and it's actually pretty flattering because it has kind of, like, a v-neck. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to choose one of these, and then I'm just going to go wash my face um, and put my hair up. Okay, so I just washed my face, threw some moisturizer on, and a little bit of concealer under my eyes. 
Um, I decided to go with the red. I don't know, since the last day in the gym, just go all out, I guess. Um, and then I think I'm going to, it's pretty cold, so I think I'm gonna throw on a long sleeve over top and just like tie it, um, or a cropped hoodie or something, we'll see. Yeah, so I just literally put on my pajama top and tied it. Um, and then, you know, like if I get too hot or whatever, I'll just take that off. Um, so, yeah, I think uh, I'm just gonna get my stuff together and then I'll be heading out soon. I actually have like half an hour, I think, before I have to leave. So, gotta make my smoothie, um, get my stuff together. I want to go to Winners after the gym because I need to look for, I'm looking for a specific shampoo and conditioner that I actually saw there. Um, I can't get it, it's like sold out on Sephora, so I'm gonna go see if they have that there. <laughs> So it definitely doesn't look good, but I think it's going to taste good. Um, I just put a lid on it and I think I still have like 10 minutes before I have to go. So I'll just kind of shake it up when I go and um, drink that on the way there. I'm just going to put it in the fridge for now. So yesterday I did my site selection um, for different, I guess I probably shouldn't be showing <laughs> the locations, but for the different um, placement options. And then I find out, I think in a couple weeks, so they have to go through all my documents and like send them to the to the places. Um, so I find out in a couple weeks where I'll actually be placed, but I'm going to be um, two days a week all through May and halfway through June. And it's either Thursdays and Fridays or Saturdays and Sundays, so May. In June are going to be very busy for me because I also have a class um, that I think are like 12 hours long once a week so I basically have three days a week that are 12 hours it's kind of like how a lot of people have like their work schedule right um, but I have some other things going on as well so anyways I'm really excited though to um, finally be doing my placement so excited about that and <clears throat> yeah I was just on Pinterest earlier looking at different recipes and basically my Pinterest usually consists of um, like what shows up on my home feed is like recipes blonde hair inspiration um, some fitness stuff and then like backgrounds I get a lot of my like phone and laptop backgrounds from here and then a lot of uh, nursing reference sheets as well so yeah i also had a little bit of a scare this morning because we received an email saying that some people didn't finish um some quizzes that they needed needed to do and that they would be talking to the program coordinators to see what the next steps are and i had a mini heart attack wondering if i finished them but luckily i did so <laughs> that <clears throat> scared the crap out of me this morning but um, we also have all of these were due, they're due tomorrow, I think, April 2nd, is that tomorrow? Yeah, so, um, I had to make sure that these were done and luckily they were. I tend to get my things like this, like self-directed learning, um, quizzes and like case studies and stuff, I tend to get them done early, that way I don't, like this doesn't happen where I forget about it and I have to do it last minute because they actually take a while, each of these has like 40 slides and we have a whole bunch that we have to do so this was like the first one second one and then I think this yeah this is I have to do this in a couple weeks so I'll probably um 
I'm gonna get started on doing these next. So anyways, um, that just gave me a heart attack this morning, but luckily I got that done and yeah. Snapchat my life away, what the fuck you do to me? Swear this shit is screwing me up like a jubilee Jump when I say so, my shit my day shows When the night time come, blunt staple take go Round and around, round and around I said she Okay, just got out of the shower, hi Um, and I figured I could talk about a few new things that I've really been liking Lately that I added to my routine So this is, um, an under eye mask that I've been liking. It's really uh, moisturizing. It says, I think it says that you can leave it on for 10 minutes or and like wipe it away or you can leave it on longer. Um, but I've just been leaving it on. I don't know if that's, yeah, it says leave on. Okay. Um, and then this, I'm sure you guys have heard of. Um, I saw a bunch of people on TikTok talking about it, of course, so I decided to give it a try. Um, I haven't really noticed any results yet, I've only, it's only been a couple days, so um, I'll have to update you on that, but I do like that it sinks into your skin really fast, um, so I like it so far. And then this, I got a sample of the last time I was at the salon, and I really liked it, so I decided to pick up um, a bottle, and I just got the small size because very very expensive but I figured I would get the small size first just to kind of try it out for a bit longer and then we'll see but it's basically for blondes um, and it's like an oil concentrate and it has heat protectant in it so got that and yeah so I'm just getting it ready now um, I was just doing some schoolwork before this but I felt like kind of like freshening up and then I'm going to I think film a video. Okay, I think I'm pretty much ready for the first thing that I want to shoot. Um, I try to fit in as many things in one day as I can when I want to make content because I don't like wearing makeup and like doing my hair and everything um, every day. So I try to kind of like fit it into one or two days a week uh, right now. I'm not going to be able to keep up with that. I already know in May and June when I have my placement and stuff, but for now, just trying to kind of get as much as I can. I wanted to wear my new hat um, for a picture potentially. We'll see how it looks, but I love the color of it. I haven't worn it out yet um, because it's been so cold, so I feel like it kind of looks stupid, but, um, but yeah, it's just Adidas hat. It's cute. Um, and you're not really going to see my bottom half in this photo or video or whatever I take, so um, I just wore leggings. Hi guys, okay, so I was going to do a whole separate video on my favorite snacks, but I realized I'm actually out of some things, um, and I don't really have that much, so I thought I would just include it in this video instead, so that's why I kind of have this, like, awkward setup here. Um, but just in case you're interested, these are kind of some, like, healthy-ish snacks. They're not all super healthy, but, um definitely filling. So this is something that my dad actually got for me. He got me um, a pack of like 12 of them. So I'm all stocked up, stocked up, but these are great for work or for school. I'm definitely going to be bringing them to, uh, to my clinical, um, but it's a vegan jerky. So it has, for half of a bag, it has six grams of protein. So 12 grams total, and it's just really filling and it's made out of vegetable protein. So um, it also tastes good. It has like a smoky taste to it. So I like those. They're just really convenient to bring with you anywhere. Um, these I had to include my boyfriend Mark's uh, grandma makes them. Um, I don't know if it's an Italian thing or what, but they're basically like breadsticks. And I like to dip these in peanut butter um, or just eat them on their own. We're obsessed with those. Um, and then another thing are these cinnamon toast, uh, what are these called? Rice cakes. Um, so I was just eating like plain rice cakes, but then I found these. These are made out of, they're, I don't know, organic. Um, they're obviously gluten-free, vegan. 
but basically what I do is I take those and I put either natural peanut butter or just like the regular, we also have just the regular craft peanut butter, depending on kind of how sweet I want it. Um, I'll just put that on top and make kind of a sandwich type thing. Um, and if you want it like extra sweet, you can put maple syrup on it. It's really good. I just got these, they're by Go Go Quinoa. Um, these are Sriracha Puffs. It was my first time getting them last time I got them and I'm already almost done the bag. These are so good. Um, and you can eat, like in the nutrition facts, it has it says per 58 puffs. So that's probably the whole bag. Um, so yeah, it's really not, it's definitely better for you than chips, that's for sure. Um, then another thing that I've been eating a lot is uh, protein shakes, which is like so unlike me, but um, <laughs> I actually have really been liking it because I throw in a bunch of stuff that I probably normally wouldn't get throughout the day. So like I'll throw in some spinach um, and then some fruit, blueberries, bananas, uh, Greek yogurt, almond milk. I kind of always switch it up, but this is a vegan protein and it's in a chocolate hazelnut flavor. Um, it's not the best. I don't know if I'll, if I would repurchase this one, but just, that was just kind of like an example of what I eat. And then I've shown these a lot in my videos. They're the Lenny and Larry's complete cookie, 16 grams of protein, uh, plant-based, 10 grams of fiber. So I normally won't eat a full one of these. I'll normally just eat like half. Um, because these aren't like, it's like 12 grams. 12 grams of fat uh, and a lot of sugar, 25 grams of sugar. So it's still a cookie, like it's still, you know, not great for you, but because it has so much protein and fiber in it, it's definitely a bit better than like a regular cookie. Um, but anyways, yeah, so lately what I've been doing is having half of it and I'll stick it in the oven for a little bit to heat it up and then kind of crumble it over like Greek yogurt or put peanut butter on it, something like that, just for like a sweet snack or dessert. So anyways, yeah, those are my little um, snacks that I've been having and I'm missing some. I have to stock up next time I go to the store, but I'll show you guys in my next video uh, what else I have been snacking on. So I'm just going to put this all away now. package for the week so not going to lie I actually ordered this by accident you know how it's like a subscription service I forgot to uh, like cancel or skip the week but we decided that it's not a big deal anyways the only thing that sucks is that I didn't get to pick the recipes it just picks for you if you don't pick by a certain date so I don't really even know what we have in here. Um, let's see. We have a Thai style curry. Um, Dukkha, Dukkha, crusted tofu and couscous bowls with chopped salad. And a double mushroom ragu, fresh tor torchiette. I don't know. Um, well, that's not bad. They sound okay. This tofu bowl actually looks really yummy, so that's cool. Um, they always throw in a bunch of like coupons and stuff for to give to other people. So, anyways, um, here are the bags. So the one thing that I will say, if you haven't tried these of um, subscription services like HelloFresh and this one. Um, oh, okay, this is actually a lot better. I was going to say Good Food, last time I ordered from them, they came with these like biodegradable pouches, but it wasn't ice. I don't know if this is the same thing. It was like a weird solution um, and it was like awkward to throw out, but you couldn't put it down the sink so 
well maybe you can't I don't know but I wasn't sure if you could or not so I put it in the garbage but anyways it was just like kind of messy whereas HelloFresh just comes with chunks of frozen ice in um, in plastic so you just cut the plastic open recycle it and let the ice melt down the drain so it's I found it a lot easier but that's just one difference between the two um, so far I've also been liking HelloFresh's recipes a little bit better but I don't even know if we're going to continue <clears throat> with the services. I mean, starting placement in May and June, I'm going to be a lot busier anyway, so it might be a good thing to uh, to continue it, but sorry, I've been like cut out of the frame this whole time. Um, yeah, anyways, in case you're wondering why I'm wearing this, I was just taking some content for something else, and then I thought I was going to film a completely separate video of the snacks and stuff, so I decided to just stay ready, but kind of awkward for this video, but that's okay. Um, so yeah, so we're just gonna find room in the fridge now. to clean the kitchen up a little bit um, and I'll update you guys once I'm doing whatever I start to do next. Hey little cutie, he has a cold uh, so he's just been sleeping a lot, the poor little guy. Um, I'm just grabbing my charging cord out of here phone's gonna die and I want to plug my I still want to be using it so I want to plug my little like charger box thingy into it um but yeah I'm basically just gonna do some chores now look at how sweet he is oh, poor little guy yeah so I'm just gonna do some laundry now and then go down and vacuum. So I vacuum two to three times a week. Our cat just sheds, sorry, I don't, this is like so weird of me to be showing you my dirty laundry. Um, our cat sheds a lot. So we just like constantly need to vacuum. I'm gonna just put this down one second. I know you get lonely. I would never leave your side when you're down, and I hope you find your life. And I know things they gonna change over time, and it's just a matter of it. Cause I know we'll be alright. Like I can't stand to be without you. Like there's something in my head saying not to leave without you. Down and now, once again. Yeah, this is just a love story. I was just about to love that's why my hands hurt. Okay, so I just finished vacuuming the <clears throat> lower two floors. I vacuumed up here the other day, so it didn't really need it. Why am I putting nothing? Um, so I'm just kind of tying things up. Sorry, guys, this is horrible filming. I know. Um, I'm just tying things up. I have these fuzzy socks on me. It's freezing downstairs. Because I should put this stuff away. Let's check on little Gray. Make sure he's okay. You too, buddy? Alright, so I'm just going to put these away and then I think I'm going to make dinner. Without you, without you. 